A dead body has been found at the home of Hillary Clinton's top aide Huma Abedning her husband, the disgraced former congressman, Anthony Weiner. The unidentified female was discovered inside the trash compactor of the Manhattan apartment complex that Huma Abedning convicted pedophile Anthony Weiner have used as a base for the last 16 years. Police had been called to the block at 1 Irving Place in Union Square. After a maintenance worker found the body, police have withheld the identity of the woman, believed to be in her 40s, until they notify her family. They do not yet know how she ended up in the trash compactor, or why, and they are refusing to rule out high-profile arrests. NBC reports her purse, full of cash, was found nearby, however according to the Daily Mail, Neighbors told police they assumed their visit was related to Anthony Weiner's conviction. Security footage also shows the woman walking into Abe and Weiner's apartment building shortly before she was found inside the trash compactor, Pix11 reported. According to the Daily Mail, Anthony Weiner and Huma Abden have owned an apartment at the address for 16 years, which was listed for rent at $11,900 a month on the same day he pleaded guilty to sexting a 15-year-old girl. Huma Abden also filed for divorce that same day, however the divorce was never finalized and they have since rekindled their relationship. The listing, posted on May 19, 2017, was taken down just days later, though it is unclear as to whether the estranged couple found a renter or if the property was taken off the market for other reasons. Their modern apartment, located on the 14th and 15th floors, has a view that overlooks Union Square Park and extends out over the Midtown skyline. There are 670 units in the apartment block, divided into four blocks, Gramercy, Village, Park, and University. There is a communal pool gym and grassy rooftop for residents to enjoy. Neighbors at the luxury apartment block told NBC when police arrived on Tuesday evening, they believed it was related to Weiner's conviction. The former congressman, currently behind bars after being found guilty of production of child pornography, is eligible to begin his three years supervised release in August 2019.